I'm going to be doing a plan with me for September 30th through October 6th and I'm doing a cat theme because the little cat was up in the corner on my planner page this week. It's the washi I'm using and the stickers are from the Joann's Big Pack. So let's get started. I'm going to use these little paws for icons for my events for the week. And then I'm putting this cat washi along the bottom of the colored box color blocked boxes. And some more skinny strip washi along the top of that. Then I decided that I wanted these paw prints a little more random looking so I'm switching every other one. And I'm using my X-Acto knife because it picks up stickers real easy. And my tweezers to lay them down. And then I'm going to stick another row of this other thin washi underneath the first cat washi. And then a thicker yarn ball washi. And finish it off again with the striped washi. And then I'm going to take these cats, and they represent my two cats, Finley and Ollie. Finley has since passed away, and Ollie has grown from that little cute kitten to be a two-year-old, beautiful, handsome cat. So I'm going to put the big cats down in this corner, and I'm using the polka dots on the bottom kind of as a background landing place for these kitties. And then there's a little meow sticker. And then I'm going to put the two smaller kitties in the opposite corner. Then add the little meow to that. Then I had these big balls of yarn that I was thinking of putting along the bottom. The green didn't quite match the blue, so I put those back. And I grabbed the smaller size of these same stickers and decided to use those yarn balls. switched out this meow to the smaller size meow. And I obviously couldn't get it straight. <laughs> And then I added some paw prints going up the side. And 
And then I pulled out my Joanne's pick again because I was looking for a uh, colorful box to cover that little note section where I add the weather every week. I think I finally settle on the greenish blue that matches the washi. And I need a little weather icon to put on there and since it's been raining so much I grab the clouds with the raindrops for this week. And then I decided to stamp again this week on the vertical line part for bullet points. And I found this little icon on these Happy Planner stamps that almost looks like cat whiskers, like half of a cat whisker. So I thought I'd Use that. Real hard to see there. Two little arrows. I have to remove the existing stamps so I can get this little tiny one on there. ink on it and try it out to see how the color is. And it's very, very faint. <laughs> so I thought I'd try it. But you can't even see it. It's so light. So I decided to get my black ink instead. And I'll speed it up. It's rather boring. <laughs> then I decided to take the dot that I've been using for the past few weeks and put that dot in between the black whiskers just to add some more color. Once again, I'll speed that up for you. And that's going to be it. Here's my final page for the week. Thanks for watching.